Hey there everybody, Fabian here again and another Alpine treasure, shall I call it. Let's quickly run through what's written on the box. This is the XA90V. Um, now, um, if you know the Alpine range, you'll know that the X range is the flagship. That is like the top of the range. Now, this says 100 watt RMS by 4. This is a 5 channel amp, that's what the V stands for. Um, it's a 100 watt RMS at 2 ohm, 1%, less than 1% total harmonic distortion. Don't worry about that, quite technical. Um, and 500 watt RMS um, at 2 ohm, and that's for your subwoofer. Okay, if you're running it at a 4 um, ohm amplifier, then you would get 75 watt RMS. Uh, at 4 ohms and 300 watt for your subwoofer. Don't make a mistake and look at thousands and thousands of watts. These oaks, these guys, under they really underrate their amplifiers. And 500 watt RMS is a lot of power. 100 watts for your door speakers is a crazy amount of power. You don't need more than that. One little amplifier like this, more than enough. Okay, the usual blue and white. Alpine boxing, we open it up, and what do we have? We've got documents, papers, all different languages to read. What I like about Alpine is this little piece. Now, if you saw, it's rated 100 watts, and the real test at full range, 140 watt RMS per channel and 560 watts uh, per channel. That is incredible. So basically, they have this thing does 40 percent more than what it actually says on the box what it's advertised for like usual alpine's, alpine's um packaging is very very good you can see it's back to go all over the world this we're going to get back to in a little while first we look at the amplifier and look at that that is a beast it's not very big class d uh, amplification but it is solid, solid, solid. Take it out. Put everything out the way. Okay, as you can see, there's no Alpine badge. There's a little light in there that switches on, obviously, uh, as it uh, lights up. The badge is loose so that you've got the choice which direction you can um, place it to. Okay, so in the package, in the parcel, in the plastic, please make sure you put your you recycle your plastic packets. This world's got enough plastic floating around. I love these Alpine plugs. You connect your, your speaker cables to it and basically it's a solid, solid plug that pushes into it. Uh, input whether low level or high level and low level and high level works with exactly the same inputs obviously you just get the alpine um, little adapters which would adapt from a speaker cable to an rca now you can see here there's uh, three 30 amp fuses green's always 30 amp that means 90 amps now 19 amps at 14 and a half uh, volts is a lot of power your power connections also got sturdy, sturdy uh, locking in uh, terminals, as you can see here. Let's take it out of the packet. Sorry for the one-handed operation. For this, I couldn't use my stand. You can see the silver trim on that side, and there's nothing on these sides. And that is where this container comes in. So that these will obviously be they plastic, but they're still good looking. These will be your silver trims going on the sides there and then the one for um, the top where the over your your connections on this side okay then over here you've got your different plugs so you can see that is decent decent plugs made for thick looks like almost four gauge it'll go in there And your speaker connections. 
probably like a 16 gauge speaker wire obviously your subwoofer wire would be slightly bigger some hardware with the allen key and then that alpine badge absolute amazing amplifier i've heard one of these solid you're not going to get more solid than this um, really really a nice piece of equipment um, stay tuned to see me install two of these in a vehicle with a pxc x09 um, it's going to be a killer system it's going to also be running on r series speakers i love the r series um, coaxials and the components for their bass response with two r series probably 10 in subwoofers that i'll be connecting to the system Stay tuned, um, please subscribe and um, like the video if you like the contents. Uh, I'm new at this, help me grow my channel and we'll see you on the next one.